Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So this week I'm going to be kind of showing you guys my DIY version of cheap curtain options. Mine are white, but with the curtain options that I'm going to show you, you can choose a variety of colors from either Ikea or Walmart. So without further ado, let's just get into it. The first curtain option that I'm going to show you is from Ikea. Before I get into that actually, I should mention that all of these curtains that I'm going to be showing are under $10 for two panels. So a curtain set is under $10. I don't like paying a ton of money for curtains. Maybe I'm just a really big cheapo person, but I mean, I like to just be able to have the basics and just have curtains that have enough privacy at night and throughout the day that I feel comfortable enough just to have curtains up and not have to use the mini blinds that come in our rental and look nice and are the correct length and width. So the first type of curtains that I'm going to show you are the Vivin, I think. Oh my gosh, it's so blown out. Sorry, Rose, we're going to block you for a second. <laughs> so they're the Vivin curtains from Ikea and this is two panels of curtains and they are $9.99 for two at Ikea. Now I know a lot of people don't live near an Ikea to get one, so I wanted to kind of throw in a review segment in this as well. Just comparing the curtains for like sheerness and like length and overall quality, just to give you guys a better idea of what you're getting into when you're buying cheaper curtains. And the second set, set, I guess, of curtains that I'm going to show you are actually not curtains at all. Uh, they are twin flat sheets from Walmart. I got mine in white, but Walmart has a variety of colors in their sheet department. And it's just a cotton blend? Yeah, it's a cotton and polyester blend. And it looks like a curtain when you put cafe rings or like the curtain ring clips on them. And I don't know, I just really liked it. So these are four... 96 4.98 at Walmart and you just buy two of these and you have a curtain set and it's very nice all you have to do is just take it out of the package and iron it and it's beautiful and done so I'm gonna go through a couple clips of just me showing you what each curtain panel looks like on my curtain rod I don't have the most expensive curtain rod so don't judge but um, I just wanted to show you how each feels and looks. The Ikea one is actually a little bit longer, but not as wide as the twin flat sheet. But honestly, it's pretty comparable. The Ikea curtain is 98 and a half inches long and 57 inches wide. And the twin flat sheet is 96 inches long and 66 inches wide. So there's two and a half inches of difference between the lengths. And Ikea curtains run a little bit extra long from my experience anyway but the twin flat sheet is a little bit wider and I like that look I like the curtains to have a little bit more flow as you can tell in the clip the Ikea one is definitely more sheer than the flat sheet which for some people that's what you want but I don't like <laughs> that I just kind of feel exposed when I close my curtains I want nobody to see in I just if I'm walking around in a towel, I don't want somebody to see that. So nobody needs to see that. So I decided to put it to the night test. And I filmed a couple clips at night showing the sheerness level just to see if you could actually see inside. So on the left side is the Ikea curtain. It kind of flipped because I'm outside. And on the right is the sheet. Now you can totally see my chandelier and bits and pieces of my table through the Ikea curtain, but you can't really tell anything through the sheet curtain uh, other than the fact that I have a light on, which I really like. But I had to give it the ultimate test. <laughs>
Now in this shot, you can see Rez dancing in the flat sheet curtain. My husband had him super close to the actual curtain just so you could get an image of his silhouette. You really can't tell any details about him other than the fact that he's a dancing dog in a window. Now as far as the texture of each of the curtains, uh, the IKEA ones feel a little bit more synthetic than the flat sheet. Obviously, if you've ever had a cotton flat sheet, you know what that feels like. It's soft, it definitely feels like cotton. The IKEA one feels more plasticky, if, if that makes sense. It just doesn't feel like a normal cotton. It doesn't feel like cotton, obviously. Let me see if it will tell me what it's made out of. It's 70% polyester and 30% cotton. The sheet is a 60-40 cotton. The curtains from Ikea is a 70-30. So there's definitely more polyester uh, than cotton in the Ikea ones and you can definitely tell. I wonder if that's the reason why it's more sheer than the sheet one because it has more polyester in it. I don't know. I'm, I'm not a, a material specialist. <laughs> but anyway, I just wanted to show you guys some cheap curtain options. I know that most people are on budgets and you can't splurge a ton of money on curtains and I thought these were really good options. If you want a little bit more sheer, but not completely sheer, $10 IKEA ones. If you want some privacy to go on your windows, which I prefer, these are the ones I'm keeping, I would definitely go with a flat sheet option. Two twin sheets, you don't have to do any sewing. If they're a little high for you off of the floor, you can always let out the bottom hem of the curtain and just hem them up a little bit shorter and that'll probably gain you two and a half to three inches of length which would be a great option if you have a little bit higher windows. Now I wanted to include this clip here of comparing the sheet next to an actual curtain. I have these curtains in my bedroom and I just took it out of my bedroom to show you but they're almost exactly the same length. I think that they are the same length but if there's any discrepancy, as I said before, you can always let out the hem and gain a couple inches that way. Anyway, I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. I hope that it was helpful to even one person. I know that it's been a struggle for me when I had no budget to find any sort of window treatment option that was affordable. So I hope this helps someone out there. <laughs> I hope you guys all have amazing weeks and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys. Say bye, Rest. Give me a pixel. You wanna say hi? You wanna say you wanna say hi? You wanna say hi? Say hi. Oh yes, I know, I know. Okay, 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 okay. Crazy, crazy dog. Okay, okay, thanks. Thank you. Oh thank you. You good girl. <laughs>